Back in April 2016, Elon Musk was asked about the Tesla Model 3 drag coefficient and his response was hopefully 0.21. But if you look at the official documents released by Tesla, you'll find that the drag coefficient is 0.23. That is slightly more than the target. But how much of a difference is this? So let's compare the drag coefficient to other EVs. In this graph, you can see that the Tesla Model 3 is still on top and is trailing by the Tesla Model S and X by just 0.01. So the drag coefficient is still really impressive and it's really good for a mass produced car. Will the change in drag coefficient affect your purchase? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching. Check out my other video where I look at a hidden camera in the Tesla Model 3 interior, which you can click right here. And I'll see you next time.